Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Against the Public for September 11th. I'm Dana Lane. Today, we're going to go through my top Major League Baseball free plays. A perfect night on Tuesday. Hope everybody everybody was able to tail. If you did, whether you won games uh, single plays or you won a parlay, congratulations to everybody. So let's try to build on that tonight. After we finish, please go over to PickDogs.com. Get involved with my uh, premium Major League Baseball plays. I will also have premium WNBA selections up there. And, of course, college football will be locked and loaded on Wednesday night. We'll try to get it up as soon as possible, but I uh, also want to make sure that I feel uh, good and I have some clarity on the accuracy of what I'm putting up. So uh, probably be up Wednesday late. Uh, maybe Thursday. We'll see how things uh, shake out. You can jump on my single plays or my MLB three pack or WNBA three pack for $49.99. Of course, my college football three pack is $54.99. They all come with a pick dogs win guarantee that states you must profit or receive an immediate site credit for the purchase price. 58.3% college football winners to start the season 134 and 97 over the last two years that's good for 3315 units of profit 59.31 percentage uh, a winning percentage you can go on uh, pickdogs.com and, and look at those uh, documented numbers uh, as soon as you're done watching this if you would like but a uh, terrific start the last two years have been great and that's the kind of consistency that your money uh, deserves so please join me this weekend i appreciate everybody that has and i appreciate everybody that will um okay let's go to your onto your free plays for wednesday and we're going to start things off and, and before i do that of course i didn't go over my all access plays and i'm sure you guys know it by heart by now but if you want to receive every play that i release for the next 30 days we'll simply just get on board with an all access pass for 11 dollars a day you can also get an all access pass for the next 90 days for less than 10 dollars a day or get on the 365 day all access pass for the next year for one low price comes out to be about three dollars and seventy cents a day get thrown on the credit card we'll pay it off a little at a time and sit back and having a tremendous college and pro football season of course you also get the nba get college basketball nhl major league baseball mlb up to this point and uh, up to this time next year again next year's nhl preseason or yeah nfl preseason so a bunch that you get over the next year and of course uh you guys being sports fans you know what goes into a year of sports so please make sure you get involved with one of those all access passes uh, it's really the only way uh to to maximize the amount of money that your bankroll can make so let's uh get to those free plays please confirm the probables uh these are probable so please confirm before placing your wagers start things off 12 35 eastern time 9 51 9 52 miami marlins against the pittsburgh pirates pirates minus a dollar 87 eight and a half over minus 15 adam mazur against bailey falter uh, we're on the over in this one, so make sure to jump on this play as soon as possible because early betting patterns show 87% of the money is also on the over with 77% of the tickets. If the side is your thing, well, 94% of the money is on the Pirates, 88% on the tickets. But nine, uh, but none of this is, is significant wagers yet, so I, I'm just kind of looking at them right now. I don't see any significant movement on the side or the total, so we really haven't had big uh, wagers yet. This is all, you know, basically uh, uh, public money. Uh, not nothing that's gonna, nothing that's gonna, uh, no public opinion that's gonna sway the money as of right now. Mazur is uh, making his ace start. He's one in three this year, a 7.49 ERA, different. Uh, or, or yeah different a decent but sure outing his last time out just two and two thirds innings allowed two hits uh, one of those a home run also gave up two walks and one earn run recent form uh, tells us a different story if you uh, go back uh, far enough because uh, Mazur has not started the game since July 26 so it's not really recent form but it's his recent form in major in the major leagues uh, he's one and one with a 7.29 ERA, and we could also pull it back a little bit, a, a little bit more, and go deeper. Uh, in his last seven starts, he's one and three with an 8.78 ERA. I'm sure he's looking forward to getting back uh, on the mound in the major leagues. Uh, now we went back and looked at his AAA numbers. Played at AAA Jacksonville this year. Played at AAA El Paso. 
three and five, six point five three ERA. Bailey Falter seven and seven, four point four five ERA. Recent form really doesn't show. Um, it kind of shows him doing exactly what he's done all year. And he's kept the Pirates in games. Uh, he needs run support to be successful. But uh, his very few times has he been the disaster that everybody predicted him to be uh, in this Pirates rotation. Over his last five starts, Falter's 2-0. But he's 2-0 because the Bucks have given him almost four and a half runs a game. Uh, they've scored five or more in 13 of his 24 games, meaning... They've scored five or more in over half of his game. So he's 7-7, seven and seven, but he's 7-7 seven and seven because he's gotten uh, quite a bit of run support, which is saying something because the Pirates don't give anybody any it doesn't give anybody run support. Uh, but they seem to, to uh, break out the bats for Falter. Uh, he does own a 6.84 ERA over his last five starts. So this is easy for us. I'm going to go over 8.5 minus $1.15. 307 Eastern Time, 971, 972. New York Mets against the Toronto Blue Jays. Sean Manaya, Bowden Francis, Francis. Mets minus $1.25, 8 over minus 15. No movement on the side yet, despite 62% of the money on the Mets. There has been, when it comes to the total, with the juice moving some, uh, we've seen eight, uh, eight has always been the total, but we've seen it move from minus $1.15 to $1.23 in some spots, which means that we could easily see an eight and a half pretty soon. So you want to uh, get on this game as soon as possible. Sean Manaya, 11 and 5, 3.43 ERA, but outside of that terrific start against the Chicago White Sox a couple weeks ago, or a couple starts ago, uh, not not as good as his numbers would indicate he, he should be. He's been getting getting hit fairly hard over his last six starts Manaya is three and one 3.86 ERA uh, but if you take out that Chicago White Sox start he's two and one with a 4.75 ERA and that paints a completely different pitchers uh, pitcher I think that we are going to see the Jays hitters go up there I think they're going to be disciplined through one maybe two pitches because Manaya uh, statistically at least is just not as good when he falls behind in the count and if that doesn't work out I think we'll see an adjustment and, and if you're betting in game kind of think about this and see uh, if they are getting the best of Manaya or if he is falling behind in the count because I think if especially that first the first time through the for, through the lineup if Manaya wins that battle I think we'll see Toronto going to the plate becoming more aggressive uh, but if the, Toronto is winning that battle and Manaya is falling behind in the count then I think that you'll see that carry through uh, the rest of the the game. Bowden Francis is eight and four, a three point seven two ERA over his last seven starts. He's four and two with a one point five six ERA over his last four games. Opponents are hitting just one seventeen. I'm going to take Toronto here plus the dollar five. Six forty Eastern Time, nine seventy seven, nine seventy eight. Tampa Bay. Rays against the Philadelphia Phillies. Phillies minus 210, seven and a half under minus a dollar 21. Shane Boz against Zach Wheeler. We've seen some movement on the side here uh, in town and downtown uh, in downtown Vegas. Consensus number has moved the Phils from minus two dollars to two ten. Although there are plenty of two dollars out there so far, or two dollars are left. There are some two o five. So if you must get on this side for whatever reason, uh, hopefully it's just to put them on a parlay. But the, if you must get on this side as a straight bet, uh, please shop for those that two dollars. I guess. I mean that's. <laughs> <laughs> my my suggestion would be just to stay away from it because $2 uh, is just over the course of the season is not a frontier bankroll. As far as the total is concerned, make sure to get on this game quick if you're going to tell us because we're seeing sevens pop up uh, because there is some professional money out there uh, being wagered. Ch Shane Baz, 2-3, and 3.27 3 ERA. Uh, his numbers have been even better over his last three starts, 2-1 and one with a 1.45 ERA. And over his last two starts, opponents are hitting 114 and 163 over his last four starts. Uh, we know what we're going to get with Zach Wheeler's 14-6, and six, an incredible 2.59 ERA. Of course, he's got a terrific strikeout to innings pitch ratio, which we love. Over his previous two starts, opponents are hitting 130 and 184 over his last 
five starts. So uh, this is the easy, easy pickings for me under seven and a half minus a dollar 22. So that does it for your free plays on Wednesday. Please go to pickdogs.com. Get involved with one of my many available packages, including my all access pass that gives you every play I release for one low price. Don't forget, it's never too late to get involved with a college football or NFL season pass. You can get either one of those for $599.99, or you can, com com uh, <laughs> easy for me, can combine them for just one price of uh, $899.99. We smashed football last year. We're off to a terrific start, both in college and pro football this year. Uh, make sure you don't miss out. College selections locked in on Wednesday. NFL selections locked in on Thursday. Don't miss out on another week. Here's your Wednesday free play recap. Miami-Pittsburgh over 8.5 minus 15. Toronto plus $1.05. Tampa Bay-Philadelphia under 7.5 minus $1.00. 22. So that does it for today's show. Thank you so much to everybody who watches on a daily basis. Please hit the like and subscribe button. Free to do. I'm for Against the Public. I'm Dana Lane. All the best to you and your wagers on Wednesday.